Hello, Happy New Year. Um, welcome to January unboxing. Um, we have got one, two, three. That's not the actually we'll use the big one first. I'm not sure what this is. But I don't think we are waiting on anything. It's not a prize, but is this big? Um Couple of things I think it could be, but there's no clue. So, Let's turn it around. Luna, Luna, I can't sit back in the seat now. Oh, not quite the other end. Luna, you're right in the way. Uh, no, you need to do one more little. There, we're in. Right. If I put it on the floor, Luna will move. I have to squish it in. Okay, so it is. Oh, wow, this came quickly. Um, I think this one I only won on. I think it was the 2nd of December. Today is, oh, today is, by the way, I think the 4th. Um, so it looks like this is, I think it was Cynthia, oh, Lisa in here. I think there should be some of their products in here. Let's have a look. It was, I think they had a 12 day of Christmas competition, I think competition, um, and I think I won day five. Um, I entered a few of them. I think their last day prize was a trip to Paris. So um, they had some lovely prizes. Uh, it is Cynthia, Cynthia. I'm sure there was something else on their handle, but it's Cynthia Bakery, French bread. So in here, there is a pear and cherry brioche. It was a New Year's Eve hamper, I think they called it. Um, some brioche rolls. Theo is absolutely obsessed with brioche, so Theo will love that part of it. Um, some really posh pink champagne truffles. It's my mummy's birthday next month, so I think I'll save these for her. A um, stone glow candle. So a pretty candle and a bottle of champagne. And this lovely hamper basket, which I find really, really handy because we put toys in them and things. I've got um, a baby shower coming up, so I'll make them into a, a little container for all the bits that I've put together. So the hamper region in itself is perfect. So thank you very much to St. Pierre French Bakery. I can't remember exactly what their handle is. Is it St. Pierre Jen? Something like that. Um, so yeah, that's some lovely treats there. I was really chuffed with that one. Um, they had some, they had like bottle of Chanel number no. five. I think they had a champagne on its own advent. They had some, they had some really nice comp competition prizes. So thank you very much to Cynthia Bakery on Instagram. Um, and this one is from Love and Gold. This was um, an advent win also. Uh, I can't remember which day I won. But they um, announced all of those this week as well. This was with, I think it was with the Lila Cosmetics. So in here we've got a few cosmetics. Congratulations on winning our 12 days of Christmas Delilah giveaway. We hope you have a wonderful Christmas and New Year. We love the old beauty team. So in here there is a lipstick so we have got lipstick that's kind of my color as well so that's um that's a lovely one um, we have also got gel line longwear brow and eyeliner <laughs> somebody's walked past probably with a dog uh volumizing defining mascara She's not as horrible as she sounds. She wants to play with them. I think it's territorial from the window. Luna, there's some foodies. Luna. Luna, what's this? Foodies? Luna, 
Luna's gone for some time out in the kitchen because it was a cat and the cat wasn't going to move. Um, so we have also got a Pure Light Compact Illuminating Powder. So that's a lovely little bunch of goodies there from Delilah Cosmetics. And that was with a Love Indulge um, Advent giveaway on Instagram. Oh, there is somebody out there. I think I can see where she was going to be now. Um, and the last one is... This one is from Fragrance Shop on Instagram. So an advent whim. Um, and it is, I think it was, but she's back in then. I was like, how on earth did she lose under the door? Um, it was a, I think it's a handbag, handbag size spritz perfume, which is actually really handy. I had one of these that I got in um my mum bought me a Marks and Spencer's advent calendar and there's a little one in there and it's actually really, really handy. So it's a twist and spritz. How do you do it? Aha, uh -huh. do you twist it? Aha, uh -huh. and then, ah, that's quite handy. Yeah, that's nice. I think there were three different, um, the fragrance shop Wonderland. So I'm assuming this is the Wonderland scent. There are three different ones that they said you could choose from. They didn't ask me which one I wanted, so they just sent one, but still, it's lovely. Um, and they're refillable, I do believe. So you could then buy, I guess, another perfume. I don't know how you put it in. There must be a way of undoing it and filling it up. But they are reusable as well. So that's a really, really lovely one. Um, that is all for today. So thank you to The Fragrance Shop. Thank you to Love Indulge. And thank you to, I'm sure it's St. Pierre James on Instagram, the handle. But it's St. Pierre Bakery. It's a French bakery shop. Um, so that is all for today. Um, that's a lovely start to January. Um, and hopefully we'll see you soon. Bye bye. Hello, it is the, I think it's the 8th today of January. Um, I've got two to unbox and one to tell you about. The one to tell you about is with McBitties. It's to win a training day with Team GB. Um, you need to buy a packet of the biscuits, uh, head to the website and you just put your email and your name in and if you win you then have to upload your receipt to confirm um which i did yesterday and they've sent me a code to be able to book a day uh they're on a first come first serve basis and there is a gymnastics day a swimming day multi-sports and cycling i believe i think we're gonna give the multi-sports one we're gonna try and take that in may so it's worth a shot i'm pretty sure it's winning moments but there are quite a few tickets to win and i think it's, it's run until march um so that was a that was a good one that's a nice experience um, this one, I think I only won this one yesterday with the Quick Fit Advent. Um, it's a Nando's voucher. I'm not sure how much it's for. It didn't say, but I think there were 10 to win on that day. Um, so, hopefully this will tell me. Congratulations in taking part in our 24 Days of Quickness competition. Congratulations on being chosen as one of our Day 13 winners. We hope you enjoy your Nando's gift card. Um, it still doesn't say, um, it must be a balance check or not. I'll have a check on that one and I will update you. I'm still none the wiser. So, um, that was with their, their 24 days of, um, Quickmas, I think it was. They had some really fab prizes in that one. I think they had actual ear pods, um, some lovely hampers, um, loads of sort of tech goodies, Huawei tablets, and there was was there an ipad i think there was a playstation so um yeah i chuffed to win that one because i tried with that one last year um year before i think they run it every christmas um it's one of the ones i do out of habit more than think i would actually win them but chuffed with that one so if i keep that there that i'm going to check it and i will update the value this one i'm not actually sure what it is um i am waiting on a couple of bits i think the place is only now kicking in again after christmas I have no idea if I'm opening this from the right way. I'm assuming so because there's tape all over it. Why am I finding this so difficult to work out? Let's try and find a bell. I'm 90% sure I've got the right way up. There's no clue on the pot, so I don't think I've ordered any new sales on the way to me either. sure this is the right way. This cat's going to take off. Uh -huh, yes it is. Right. 
Oh, this was, uh, it's an advent competition with m and They had a, a daily advent um, and it was things like uh, I think it was socks and, oh, this is huge. So we won an m and mug and we won some m and m They had, um, I think you just had to literally comment and tag a friend every day and there was similar prizes, sort of similar value prizes. I think some were Christmas tree socks. Um, and sweets, uh, and some are just sweet, some with the mug. I love this, this is cool. That is a big mug though. So um, that was thanks to M&M's Advent and that was run on Instagram. So thank you to M&M's and thank you to McVitie's and thank you to Quickfit on Instagram. No, I think I won that one on Facebook. I entered on altering platforms, but I think I won on Facebook because they tagged my name, not my handle. Um, so that is all for today. I will find out how much is in the gift card and update you in the next video. That's all for now. Bye-bye. Hello, today is the 11th of January. Um, this one I did open by accident, uh, but I do think I told you about it last last unboxing, maybe. Um, it was things that we won that we couldn't unbox, but they actually sent the physical vouchers in the end. Um, and it was the My Festive View one from Shell. So there's £50 worth of Shell vouchers here. Um, and we're taking uh, Sparwin next month. That's a couple of hours drive away. So I think we'll save that for then so it feels like even more of a free weekend. So um, that was the Instagram competition. You had to share a photo of your festive view. Ours was when we, we spent Christmas in um, Inverness. So it was a, a road with snow, snow mountains. Um, so that was a, a nice little win to start the new year from Shell on Instagram. Next up, we have this one, which is a win for Luna. Here is Headbutt in the cap flap right I'm now. Luna! Yeah, yeah, there's, well, I think there's a book in here, and if there is, you probably would like the book. Oh. Oh. Right. What? So this is from Canine, Ooh. Canine Cottages, I think. But they ran this one with yappy.com. To save that till the end of the video, don't go and pop them all over this, will you? Save it till we finish the unboxing. There should be three things. This is an advent. Aha, this is awesome. So this is, um, where's Wally style? It's where's Luna? <gasps> Wait, where? I see. You gotta find Luna. <laughs> that looks like her as well. <laughs> that looks like Luby. <laughs> well, look see. at that. So you gotta find Luby in that book. So let's have a look. Oh, this is awesome, look. This is often the case when something's gone wrong in his eyes. Wanted, Luna. Luna's head on the cat block. Please open the little bag. I think she's trying to tell you if she wants to go outside. Let me see if I Let's go for walkies. The Poor Seasons Hotel, Bark in the Park. Oh, this is awesome. I think this is awesome. Can we read it? We can in a sec. Let's just finish the unboxing and we'll have a proper look at it. That's from yappy.com. Wait, you see if you can spot Luna. That is real funny. That's it. Luna's more brown. Luna's more brown. That's not Luna. <laughs> Luna has her own Instagram page, doesn't she? We can put that on. That looks like Luna. Mum? Mum? Uh, that's uh, more of a... Hug. Mum? Yeah. Mum? That looks like Luna. That looks a bit similar. Luna has had a couple of personalised bowls on her time. She like smashed Luna. them all when she was Mom. a puppy, so we gave Mom. up. But now, she's got one with her mugshot on. <laughs> that, um, this looks like new knob. <laughs> Luna that needs a haircut. I'm sure there's uh, something else with this. <laughs> mm. What that looks like new knob, Mum? There was three parts, but there's only two in there. Luna. There was a bandana. There's nothing in the other bubble wrap, is there? No. Maybe that's coming separately. We need to um, find Nooney. Uh, uh, yeah, need, so that was, I think that was meant need, to be a bandana as well. We she probably to wouldn't be looking or wearing there, but we've got the bowl. You need um, to buy Nooney and uh, oh this awesome, awesome book. There's Luna. <laughs> oh, there we go. We found her. <laughs> Luna. Hello. Outside. Right. This next one, I think, oh, is a prize that I won. Wow. I'll bring it back. I've got scissors. Here you go. Right. So this one, I is it? That's what I think it is. Hold on a second. Let me just wiggle it out. Yeah, wow. this one's for mummy and for daddy, and it was run with Bear Bell. Um, we have some of their protein bars actually, and I love the 
It's a mint one. There's an almond one. Um, and we won a box of them and a 110 euro voucher for Jim Puff Coffee. Um, I'll show you. It's a website. So it's a no, 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 can you calm down? Calm down. Um, so this one is Daddy's one. What's in here? I only ordered these. Ordered. These arrived the next day, actually. So Daddy's got a green hoodie. <laughs> Instead of getting the full gym kit, which they suggested that you got as the prize, I got Mummy and Daddy one each. So you can't really see. Mummy, you going to the gym? Big green. Mm, I don't really go to the gym. I find gyms intimidating. Um, what about like athletics and oh, that? Running. No, I prefer to exercise outside of gym. Gyms are. I just don't like gyms very much. And That's I got a nice. white one. So it's from this company just here, Gym Plus Coffee. Oh, Hold right on, Theo, because you've just done painting. I don't want to get any paint over anything. Right, let's pop all these down here. Mm -hmm. So they're out of the way of any paint. Now we have to do this one. Right, so that was um part of the Bear Bells prize. That was play. a that was an advent uh, competition. And I can't remember what day that was. Possibly day twenty. One of the 20s, I think. So that's a letter from them. Thank you. Right, let's open this last one. I'm not sure what it is. My dog. I'm a little I don't know. There was no clue on this one. Oh. There's no clue. Hey. I don't know. I really don't know. Oh, I want it to be me. It might be. Is it a prize? Yes, it is. It's the other part of that prize. Aww. It is the white chocolate and almond Bear Bells bars. Ooh. I'm going to have quite so, a those. Dad, no, these are really for Daddy because Daddy's the one that eats the protein bars. So, um, thanks Aww. to Soph, I'm sure it was Soph James, Soph James maybe, Aww. and Bear Bells ran that one together. Um, well, then you need to enter some competitions, don't you? You have to do some drawing ones, you have to find some. Yeah. But Luna, Luna, we've got this book, we can do this book. <laughs> the book's a fun one. How um, did Luna even win those? She didn't, Mummy helped her. Uh, oh. So yeah, I did tag her Instagram account as who I'd give it to our dog. Um, I don't know if that does help. Yeah. It's like dog world. But um, I'm... yeah, so thanks to Canine Cottages, I'm sure it's Canine Cottages, and Yappy.com, who supplied that prize. Thanks to Soph James and Bear Bells for the Gym Plus Coffee and the Protein Bar Prize. And thanks to Shell, um, chessboard. Giant can't remember chessboard. what their handle is, Shell something or other on Instagram for their festive view competition, which fan prize. So that is all for today, um, and hopefully we will see you soon. You say bye-bye. Bye. 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 I know it is January the 20th. I'm slowly losing my voice. Um, I've just come back from another amazing weekend away with um, some fellow compers, uh, Nikki from the Glam and Geeky YouTube channel. Um, there's Emma, and you know Emma Goff, and Hannah again. Uh, we went to Hannah won this again. We did it as a group effort. We all tried, but Hannah was um, she aced it again. And it was for it was con with Conrad Hotels, so we had a Broadway themed afternoon tea. So we had kind of um, cakes themed a lot around Lion King, uh, Mary Poppins, Wicked, and Phantom of the Opera. It was really really lovely. Um, and then we went to see Wicked, uh, and we also had me and Hannah stayed in a hotel because she only won that for two sadly. But Emma did stay in London as well, and Nikki lives locally. Um, and I also won lunch for two at Megan's, which me and Hannah did the next day. Um, what else did we do? Oh, Hannah won some cocktails and canapes. Um, it's somewhere I'd never heard of. It's called Vicinity in London and it's down by Tower Bridge. We had an amazing, like a fire pit view of um, London Bridge, uh, Tower Bridge. So it was um, it was a really, really lovely weekend. Uh, and I think I'm suffering for it today. We've also, our boiler's broken, we have no heating and there was a frost last night, so I'm freezing. Um, I've got a few little ones, but Theo's gone bowling with Daddy and he's just asked me to wait for him because I said I was undoing it. I've got two massive boxes here, which I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to lift it out of, so I might need Zerda's help when he gets back anyway. But this was an advent win, and it was um, a final day of the advent, so it's something I've wanted for a long time. If I can get it out of the box. And you have, for this one, you just had to say what your favourite Christmas dessert was, I think. Um, and 
one of the ones we love to make at Christmas is the black forest trifle. I love chocolate and cherries, and everyone loves trifle. My nan makes an awesome one. We tweak it every year. Um, right, so it was with. You probably guess where it is. It was in KitchenAid. It was their final day. Um, of their advent. Oh, am I going to be able to lift it? And it was three items. It was the KitchenAid mixer. Um, I was assuming it was in red. So it was a KitchenAid mixer, it was a KitchenAid food processor and a KitchenAid blender, I think. So I was over the moon with that one. So I was trying with the Advents and I would have been chuffed with the, the mixer on its own, but with the other, the other two components, it's amazing. So that was just a simple comment. Um, and I think you might have had to tag a friend. And I entered this one on Instagram. I know they ran it on both platforms. And I did notice they chose a winner on Facebook as well. So I think you could win on both platforms with that one. It wasn't one prize and they choose between the two. Um, I don't even know if I can get this out of the box. Is there anything to hold it? No, there isn't. Let me just try and cut down the side of the box. An exact fit of the box, and there's no grubby bits on the side. Oh, yes, there is. Whereas on that one, oh, there's this one. As if it will come out of the box. No, it won't. I need a two man job. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop you. I'm going to come back when all three of them opened. Right, I made it. I unboxed them all. So we have got the drink, the mixer. I've wanted one of these for so long. Um, so they are all in red. Uh, there's also here the food processor. I know it's black on the box, but it is red. Um, and here we have blender. So um, I'm so, so chuffed with all of this. Um, and that was the last day of the advent. And like I say, I won this one on Instagram. And that was with KitchenAid. They ran um, a competition every single day. Um, and I thought it was out of luck. And on the 28th, I think we were on our way back to Inverness. I found out I was a lucky winner. So um, thank you very, very much to KitchenAid. I wish you'll enjoy all of these. Um, I will wait for Theo and we'll be back in a minute with the other prizes. Hello, we're back again. I've got my little helper who has a mask of chocolate. He's quiet for once. Um, firstly, this one, uh, I don't know if you remember the Canine Cottages um, prize or one in the advent with Luna's bowl in her book. It was with Yappy.com. I said there was supposed to be a bandana. Um, it did turn up uh, a couple of days later. Um, so Luna has got her own snazzy. This is the company that it was one with. Yappy.com. And this is her bandana. So Luna can wear this. It's got her name on and her little face from the book. So uh, Luna will be thrilled about that. So um, we've got a little bandana for Luna. And also with that one, we got the feet, the feeding bowl with her name on and the Where's Luna book, which was really fun. And we have done that a couple of times since. Um, right, next up, we have got this one, which I think is an advent prize from on Instagram. And they did a daily one from up until Christmas. From Fia. No, not for Fia. Sorry, not for you. This is from Bar Chick Official, I think. Am I going to find out, though? I can't remember which day we won. I think it was the 22nd or the 23rd, perhaps. And it should be a bottle of Brooklyn Gin. I've had it sent from Amazon. Look at this. It's a bottle of Brooklyn Gin. Um, and they ran an uh, advent competition every single day um, for an alcohol-related prize. Uh, it says, enjoy your gift, love, bar chick. So um, that was the only one from Magic Official. Uh, I think you had to tag a friend or two. Um, there wasn't a lot, a lot more to theirs. And they had some fab ones, and that's a lovely bottle. So um, we will be enjoying that. Luckily, I didn't choose to do. But have we got another bottle? We have. We got this one, which I think is from a company on Instagram again called Banana Moon Clothing. I could be completely wrong, but I think it's the only soft and squishy thing I'm waiting on. Yes, it is. So this is from Banana Moon Clothing on Instagram, and it was um, a December competition. I don't think it was an advent. We were choosing 
five winners on Instagram to win a grey hand scarf set and five winners on Facebook to win it in navy. So I've won the grey one. Look, Mummy's got a hat like you. And I've got the gloves to match. And I've got a lovely chunky scarf. I love this. So this is a lovely set. I don't actually have a proper set with a hat scarf and gloves for me. So um, I was chuffed with that one. You're going to try my hat on? Oh, you look lovely with your grey jumper. <laughs> So that was um, Banana Moon clothing on Instagram. I think you just had to tag, I don't know if it was to say where you'd wear it um, and tag a friend. Um, so that was Banana Moon clothing and we got the Brooklyn Gym from Bar Chick Official, the Yappy.com bandana and this one, I think this is the first part of this. I won this on Instagram. I think they ran this on Facebook and Instagram. Uh, the winner was chosen on Instagram and I was lucky enough to win this one. From We Are Super You on Instagram, and it was run with Nutribullet. Um, I won a couple of Nutribullets a couple of years ago, I think, in the Bell Vita one and Simply Health on Instagram. Um, I gave one to my mum and one to Serge to take to work with him, and I wasn't really left with one. And at the minute, I'm borrowing mum's again just for January. That's why I try and be healthy. And um, mom, I actually made mom, two seconds. See, that's my birthday. Yeah. I actually um, made a smoothie the day they announced this with the one that I borrowed off mum and um, uploaded it, not thinking I'd actually win this. It's it a lot of entries. Yeah, it's for me. It's, 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 it's not really for you, sweetheart. It is, it is, it is. It is. Please, please, it please tell me it isn't. Please tell me it is. No, well, we can make milkshakes in it. Oh, it's another one that's impossible to get out of the box. Two seconds, Lee. So let's sit on your chair. Do you want me to walk? Um, we also won, don't you get, we also won some of their products, this We Are Super You products, but we haven't received those ones yet. Watch out then, I'll put it on the table and you can see it. So we a Nutribullet bullet balance. I don't know how the balance one differs from the, um, I think we had the 600 series one, this is the last one I won. Um, this one, a revolutionary, watch out a second. A revolutionary smart nutrition sensor technology connects the Nutribullet bullet balance and app to your device to calculate real-time nutritional info. Build the perfect nutri blast based on the dietary requirements, needs, and nutrition goals every time. Oh, that's cool. So you can get an app and make it, um, well, there's recipes and everything on there. Oh, that's pretty cool. So, um, yeah, thank you ever so much to We Are Super You and Nutribullet for that one. Um, and like I say, we are waiting on some products from Super You which haven't arrived yet. So um, that is all for today. So thanks to We Are Super You, Banana Clothing, Yappy.com and Bar Chick Official. So hopefully we'll see you soon. You can say bye-bye. Oh, he's walked off with a bag on his head. You can say bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Okay. <laughs> see you soon. Bye-bye. Hello. Uh, sorry, I am wearing a coat. It's because our heating broke a week ago and it's only just come back on and I'm absolutely freezing. Um, so I'm just waiting for her to warm up. Uh, I have just received a message before I forget, um, so I don't think it's going to be a unboxable prize. And it's from a company on Instagram called Carl Scarpa, and it's um, Ladies Italian Shoes. And I won their New Year competition, which was a £200 voucher, so I was super chuffed with that one. Um, I don't, I've only literally just seen it, so I'm now going to read a bit more about it. Can't remember how I entered that one. I would imagine it was a um, just a comment and tag, so I don't remember doing anything sort of above and beyond for that. Um, so that's a lovely surprise. Um, so £200 to spend on shoes. I have two here, uh, which I'm assuming are prizes, because I don't think I'm expecting anything that I've ordered. Um, but I'm not sure what they could be. I think actually I know what one of them is. Right. Oh, I take this off in a minute. Oh, this one was with Love Raw. So it's Holy Moly on Instagram. It's this company here. Um, and it was to win some of their products and some Love Raw products. So they obviously sent their part of it. Um, so there's a cocoa and hazelnut cookie. There's two of those. They are gluten-free, vegan and no refined sugars. Um, and there's an almond hemp and chia seed cookie. Two of those. And there is cocoa and orange cookie. Um, so there we go, and like I say, they are from, holy moly, 
handmade vegan gluten-free high fiber and no refined sugars they'll be good for zaki's lunchbox actually um we're trying to keep all the lunchbox snacks healthy this year how much um how long we'll keep that for i don't know he always seems to creep back to his um Go pop cereal bars and things eventually. But we'll keep it going as long as we can. So that was from Holy Moly, um, and I'm assuming the love roll will follow. This one was another kind of snacky one, a good lunchbox one, and this was from Popcorn Shed on Instagram. Um, and the company that this was, they did a collaboration with Chipped, I think it was. I think I've got an online voucher for that one um but this was the popcorn so they have sent i think it was mini pop so it's this company here popcorn shed uh that's their logo um and they're on instagram oh yeah mini pop so it's salt and vinegar mini pop sweet and salty sweet and salty oh toffee toffee rum uh oh white truffle a white truffle one sweet and salty oh no salty rather sea salt another toffee another sea salt another white truffle and another salt and vinegar so that's a fab one that's more lunchbox snacks there they'll be really really handy Zachy loves popcorn um i don't know how many mini is but they look oh extra size so they are teeny tiny um and that yeah so that was one with the popcorn shed and chipped food on instagram um so once i've ordered the chipped bits i will unbox those as well so both of those ones were collaboration ones so thanks to holy moly and love raw which i haven't received yet and to popcorn shed and chipped which i haven't received yet so um that is all for today and i hopefully see you soon bye bye hello no sooner had i pressed stop um another parcel arrived I know what this one is. Uh, this was uh, an advent one. It was, uh, I think they did 12 days of Christmas on this one. Um, and it's one that I entered after Christmas, I think maybe even in January, uh, with a company called Mazoral. Uh, it's a hair care company. They do shampoo products and things. Um, and they had, I think, that all the prizes were really, really good prizes. And they had the first 11 prizes where you had to comment on the Instagram post or Facebook, I think. Um, and then the last one was, I think it was the last one, might not have been the last one, but you had to share a picture of your festive hair. And I had this, I thought it was an awful picture of me with Christmas tree hair. Um, so it's this company, this company just here. Um, and I had the, it's like a plastic cone in my hair. It was all up like this with lights around it. And I don't think it was the best picture. And I entered that one on the off chance. There was a few that I thought were better than mine because they didn't have a scan through the entries. Um, and I won, and it was an amazing prize. It was a £10 Boots voucher, so the gift card's just there. And it was um, a Dyson air wrap. So I'm going to get out of the box. Um, I won this with my, my, mine was an Instagram entry, but I think they, they took into consideration Facebook ones as well. I don't think it was run on Twitter, but I could be wrong. Um, so it is a Dyson Airwrap Complete. Um, these are fantastic. And it's not something I would have justified being able to spend the money on, which makes it um, an even bigger treat. I think they're around the £400 mark. Um, so yeah, I'm really looking forward. It's got the pre-styling dryer, the pre-styling dryer, a 30 millimeter air wrap barrel, 40 millimeter air wrap barrel, firm smoothing brush, soft smoothing brush, round, round volumizing brush. Um, so it looks amazing. I can't wait to try that out. So that was a really, really nice win from the advent. Um, and that again was with Nazoro. Um, I think they also had things like Beats headphones. I think they had a hair dryer. Um, I think it was a silk satin pil uh, pillowcase covers. Some of their products. There was loads. There was really there was a lot of um, good prizes with that one. So again, that was a twelve days of Christmas uh, post Christmas advent competition, um, and I am chuffed to bits with that. So thank you to Nizoro. Uh I will look forward to using that. I might actually read up on that tonight and have a play around. So that is all for today. Uh, what is today? January the twenty second, I think. So hopefully we'll see you soon. Bye bye. Hello. Today is the I think it's the twenty third. No, twenty fourth. Twenty fourth today. 
I've got what I think is three. Um, I know what two of them are. I don't know what this one is. You are right in my way, aren't you? This one is a chop check. Um, it is for a complimentary lunch to the value of £10. Um, it's for the chopped, uh, I think there's one in London, uh, which I'm going to use next month. Um, they're like salad bars, and that, that was part of the, which one was that? Holy Moly was with Loved Raw, Love Raw, and this one was with the popcorn shake one. So um, that was £10 um, to spend on salads for lunch, so I can use that next month. Um, this one. I'm not entirely sure that this isn't something I've ordered. But I also can't think of anything that I've ordered. So let's have a look. Actually, this could be the Love Raw bars. If they're in like a selection box type thing, which they possibly are. Yes, it is. Love Raw. So, um, this one was the other part of the prize with Holy Moly, the, um, the cookies. And we've got some congratulations, Gemma. Enjoy and please tag us at Love Raw. So there's five different ones in here. There is salted caramel, peanut butter, cookie dough, hazelnut butter, oh that sounds nice, and peanut brownie. So these ones are um, vegan also. Are they all vegan? Not all of them are they? Yes they are all vegan. Is that one as well? Yes. So they're all vegan and they're um, like peanut butter cups for all different butters and flavours. So they will be nice to try. I've never tried those before. Um, and I think that was just a tag a friend. Um, and I commented on both pages because they both ran the competition. Um, sometimes um, I find it does help tagging both in the comments. So that was from Love Raw and Popcorn Shed. We got the other part of the prize from, no, 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 this was Holy Moly, wasn't it? Holy Moly and Love Raw, Popcorn Shed and Chop. Um, and this one, this is a weird one. Um, it was with, it was run with White Glow on Instagram. They did a competition. You had to buy uh, their product and take a Charlie's Angel themed picture, I think it was. Um, and I think the competition, they announced this competition early in December, I think, maybe even late November. Uh, there wasn't a great deal of entries. And in the last couple of days, they changed the terms and conditions to all you had to do was tag three friends. So obviously then entries skyrocketed. Um, and I had done mine, I still uploaded it anyway, uh, and the lady messaged me back and said that due to something out of their control, they had to change the mechanism of the competition and they had to change it to tag in friends instead of a creative um, entry. But she said because I had done a creative entry, they would send me a goodie bag, which I did suspect would probably count me out of the main prize. Um, so they have sent dissolving whitening films. I think they're the, the whitening strips. Um, a traveller's pack. That's quite cool. It's handy because we're often going away. Um, white Glow Professional Choice Toothpaste. Um, this, oh, coffee and tea drinkers formula. Which is handy for me. Um, and... The white glow night and day toothpaste. So I got these ones for just for literally just uploading um, the creative entry, which I would never have been guaranteed to win anyway. So they didn't have to do that. So that was really nice of them. So thanks to White Glow for that one. That was run on Instagram. Uh, to Love Raw. Um, the other part of that was Popcorn Shed. No, it wasn't. It was Holy Moly. And the other one on the Love Raw. So Love Raw and Holy Moly. I'm so confused. It was the Chop Check and popcorn shed that was 100 percent, and it was love raw and holy moly they were two competitions two companies in them yes so that is everything for today and i hope we'll see you soon bye bye hello today is january the 30th um i've got a big one here and it's not mine it's actually for serge but it's been sitting here for a few days and he's not home for another couple so i'm gonna open it for him because it's a bit in my way um this one i tagged him in it and I, I think I've entered with this company for geez, as long as I can remember, whenever I see one, I'm done to it. And I always do a decent comment. And um, I tagged him in it. And it's the first time he's entered with them. He wrote one word and one. <laughs> and the name of the it, caps. Um, it was weird. It was on Instagram. Um, and I did look back and I think all he wrote is Ace. 
<laughs> I think that was his word. Um, and he won. What breaks me up on this kind of thing? It's a, I think it's a wet and dry Hoover. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get this out. I'm going to come back when it's open. Alright, sorry, there we go, I'm in. Um, I have no idea what you actually use a wet and dry here before. He really wanted it. Um, what is it for? Workshop version, use maintenance power, rust resistant. I don't know, he's obviously got something in mind for it, um, but I don't know what you use it for. But yeah, like I said, he just wrote one word, so I'm guessing that they're not really big on comments on that one. Um, or maybe it's because he's a man and he might be able to use it more than a woman, I don't know. But he um, nailed that one first time, and I think I've tried for years. So well done to Serge on that one. So that was from Silverline Tools on Instagram. I do actually think all you had to do for that was like and follow. I don't think you had to comment, so... Um, Maybe it was literally a random draw. Um, that is all for today, and it is the 30th of January. I am expecting a few things, but whether or not I get anything before tomorrow, I don't know. So if I don't, everybody have a really lucky February, um, and I will see you soon. Bye-bye. Hello, sorry, I popped out for a couple of minutes, and I had another two, so just in case um, I don't have time tomorrow, I'm going to quickly unbox them now. Um... This one is from, it's from Kurt Geiger. I don't actually, I don't know how you pronounce it, Carvella, Carvella. Um, shoes that, there was a competition on Instagram and me and my friend both entered because it was for you and a friend. Um, and we both entered uh, and Hannah actually won. So this is thanks to Hannah because she loved, she kindly chose her, um, her friend's pair to give to me. Um, and we went, we went to that, didn't we? we went in, in store and we tried a few pairs on, um, just because I'm a bit fussy with shoes, so I didn't want, when it's a competition, I didn't then want to have to return it, um, over there. So I have chosen some, I don't often wear trainers, because I'm not the most sporty of people. Um, let me get in here, here we go. Uh, but these ones are quite bitsy. Uh, hey Gemma, we hope you love your new shoes. Don't forget to tag up Carvella Official in any photos wearing them. So there's my little thank you card. And I love these! So I got these ones and I really, really love them. Um, I tried them on a store. They fit like a glove, so they were definitely, definitely the ones I was going to choose. I did like the boots, but because I've got quite um, small calves, they always gap on me, sadly, so I can't really pull off the boots. Um, but I love these. So these are um these are awesome. These were a hundred pounds, um, which is fantastic. So they are my springtime trainers. So thanks ever so much to Hannah and to Carvella on Instagram. Um they've run quite a few lately. Uh most of them have been for you and a friend. I think they've won I don't know if it's still running now, but they did have one, I think it was for a bag for you and a friend, she's a bag. Um but they're worth keeping an eye on. Um and Hannah got really lucky on that one. Um and as a result, so did I. So thank you to Carvel and Hannah for those ones. And then this one, I don't know, this was a collaboration competition, I think, I'm saying that, but it's the only thing I'm expecting from Nine Brand Foods. Uh, it was run again on Instagram and it was with UFIT. Um, and it was for some of the Nine Brand bars. I think it's a vegan, it was a veganuary one, um, and it's the, the crunches, is it? The you fit crisps they do. Serge likes those, and I like the bars, and so does Zaki for lunchbox. So, pretty good prize all round. If only Theo that's fussy and won't benefit from this one. So, in here, there, they didn't actually have very many entries on that. Um, I've looked at a few of their competitions recently, and none of them have been um, stacked with entries. Uh, and there's actually more in here by the looks of it than I thought I was going to get. So there is a mixed case of nine bars. How many is in there? Not sure, quite a few I'd imagine. Um, and another mixed case. I think they've put lots of different flavours in there. Um, so they've stuck the stickers on top as opposed to the flavours on the boxes, which is handy. Um, Wowzers, there's a lot more than I thought there was going to be. Uh, what is that? Open for a nutrition explosion. 
I'm assuming that something's fallen out or that's in there to keep everything still. Um, I would imagine they are to stop every rolling round. Yes. Right, these must be the well there's a box so you'll be pleased with those. I thought it was gonna be a, a handful of each, which I was gonna be pleased with anyway. So it's obviously um a box of each flavour. So there is the salt and vinegar and the barbecue ones. I don't think you try the salt and vinegar. Um, so these be handy for Serge for work. Um, they're like crisps, but they're higher protein ones. I think they're eight grams a bag. Um, so yeah, that's um, that's a lot more than I was expecting. I'm really pleased with that because like I said, I thought it was going to be a handful of goodies, um, which would be great for lunchbox and Serge anyway. So yeah, really chuffed with that one. They're worth keeping an eye on, um, Nine Brand and UFIT because I think this one had about, I think it was 60 or 70 entries. So there's not a lot on them. I think they're running one at the minute with plant-based protein, I'm sure, because I'd entered that one as well because they hadn't announced the winner for this one yet. Um, so yeah, you fit and nine brands are worth keeping an eye on on Instagram. Um, that is all for today. And like I said, if I don't see you again before tomorrow, then have a super lucky February. Bye-bye. Hello, it is the 31st of January, so it's the last dead month. We had one, um, and he's dressed to Theo. I haven't entered many children's ones for a while, so I don't know what it could be. Um, but nonetheless, we're ending the month with a room for Theo. So, did you see what's in here? Yeah, I'm, I'm a, I can... Can we pull this bit? What can it be? What can it be? It's a puzzle. It looks like a Tonka. A Tonka Tonka, what is it? A Tonka... Oh, what's that one? Oh, I do remember. I think this was one of the ones in possibly busy time. Um, we got this and everybody. We, got... we had some of these before, didn't we? Yeah. So he's got one of these. Um, a Tonka Real Tough 3 pack. I think it's these little tinies again. The garage. He won a little selection from UK Mums TV, I and think, then, last year. And then this. Look, you've got the big lorry to put all your little tinies on. Remember you have all the little tiny garages? Like this one? Yeah, and, and then look, you have to put them all in there. That is pretty cool, isn't it? Look what we got here. And wow. we've, got, we've, we've got all these. Yeah, I think I remember this one. It was in, um, I think it was Busy Time or one of those. I think there's an advert in there. Um, There's like a, a competition. I think they all get sent to a similar place. But it's like hey, a It's different to Mom, the, the entry it form. Email. Oh, wow, it does. Um, so yeah, he's got a little Tonka lorry with, oh, with look, all his minis in, in there. little tinies. He's in the picture. He's not, he's next to the picture. He's just shoved loads of chocolate in his mouth, hasn't he? So he can't even move his mouth. He's going to his kinder bar. I'm not opening. Um, we will in a second. We're going to say, show everyone one last time. Oh, and then we'll say bye-bye. It's got lots of tinies in, hasn't it? So there we go. There is no note, as per usual with the magazine ones. There never seems to be. Um, but I do oh, remember look. sending that entry form off. Mum, there's a load of minis. There is. I think we've got one very happy Theo, which is um, handy because Zaki's won one of the Cadbury's legend stickers and that'll save a fight there when no, they arrive. you so. have this one and I have this one. Okay. Right, you're going to say bye-bye? Bye-bye. Say good luck for February, everyone, and we'll see you good next month. Good luck for February.